Many area schools are now getting tourniquets and other medical supplies in addition to their first aid kits. The decision comes from schools responding to the need of having immediate medical supplies in case of a violent event. Kate Stephanie Minichi has the story. The Wichita Metro Crime Commission distributed free Stop the Bleed kits to Sedgwick County School Districts on Friday. Keeping youth safe is a primary goal of the Crime Commission. After the Sandy Hook school shooting, it was determined many lives could have been saved if the kits were available. According to medical director Dr. James Hahn, these kits serve as a temporary fix. If you can stop the bleeding and get them to a place where there's blood available and there's surgery available, a lot of the people will live. If they've already bled to death before they get to me, it doesn't do any good. Han says these kits can serve other purposes outside of mass shootings. There have been kids who've been hurt in wood shop and they actually had an arterial bleeder using a tourniquet for that. There are actually higher speed car wrecks than you think in any of those parking lots or just have getting out of school on main areas. That's another area that you're probably more likely to use this kit. For. He adds tourniquets shouldn't be limited to schools. It should be in the airport, it should be in the movie theaters, it should be at the mall, it should be pretty much anywhere where you see one of those little boxes that says defibrillator. Derby Safety and Security Director Matt Liston's schools already have emergency kits, but feel having more better prepares them. In our district, we have emergency backpacks in all of our classrooms. We have emergency kits in the office that have a lot of that stuff. Nurses have that stuff. This is just giving us more to be able to use depending on the number of victims that you might have. One grandparent is not against tourniquets being in schools. He just wonders if it sends the wrong message. I see it's a sort of a manifestation of a huge, much larger societal issue about you know violence and you know, just you know, extremism and polar, polarization and stuff like that. Han says the kits are designed for anybody to use. He urges people to get familiar with them so you can teach others how to use them. Stephanie Minichi, Cake News on your side.